I am Sanjeev Agarwal. I am the head of the Mass Department at Shivnadar University, and that's Professor Ambar Habib. He is also a senior professor at the Department of Maths, and he is also heading the institute, a research institute that we have got in Shivnadar University. Ambar. Yes, so that institute is the Institute for Innovations and Inventions with Maths and IT, and uh, it's uh, the job of this institute will be to uh, bring mathematics in contact with every kind of activity with other departments in the university, with real world problems uh, of society everywhere and of every kind. So, setting up this institute was one of the reasons that Ammar and I decided to join SNU, along with some several very good young faculty members in maths. One of the reasons uh, we have been involved with uh, education of students for several years. Along, uh, I was teaching in a college in Delhi. Ambar and I were involved in an NGO which was working with maths education for the general public. We were always been very concerned that the maths education is really not fulfilling the purpose that it should. And we were looking for a place where we could offer a degree programs at the undergraduate, postgraduate and further where the student will get all the opportunity to learn everything in mass along with interdisciplinary and multidisciplinary uh, type of options so that you can do degrees where you can use maths as well as other things. And we joined basically because SNU offered this opportunity as well as uh, gave us a chance of setting up this institute where we will be setting up research groups to work with real world problems. Yeah, I think so. In in India, there is there is a big problem with mathematics, and there is a particular problem with the divorce between mathematics and other subjects. And so, for many years, uh, we had been worrying about this and had some dreams of doing something about it. And when we came across SNU, which was just being founded, we found that here uh, was a university that we could really relate to with the general ambitions and dreams of the university corresponded uh, so well to our particular dreams about mathematics and what we hope to do uh, to promote mathematics and its applications and its relationships with other subjects. Uh, so as I said, particularly in India, this has been a major problem where mathematicians have not talked to other uh, subject areas uh, or people who could use mathematics are not aware that they could benefit from it, they don't know who to approach. And our institute, for one, is going to be a place uh, which breaks down these barriers and uh, we will bring mathematics uh, to everyone else and uh, provide a, a place which, which can focus on, on these issues. And we also believe that uh, university education should not only be restricted to the students of the university. So one of the activities that we have been doing at an NGO that I mentioned earlier is a summer internship program called Inviting All Young Minds. And this year and all the subsequent years, we will be offering this as a part of IMET activity in SNU. So would you like to say something about IAYM? Okay, so this is a very interesting summer program. What we do or have been doing is every summer we bring about, collect 60 students from all over India of various ages, from high school uh, to college, even master level students. And they work in teams of five or six on various uh, problems where mathematics and computing uh, can be applied and can help resolve those problems. And the task is to get our students to think in new ways, not to just say take a process from a book and implement it, but to really think about the problem afresh uh, for themselves and do something potentially new. And the really fun part is that a group of five may have a student who's a mathematician, they may be a physicist, they may be an economist, they may be someone from English or commerce and five people thinking about uh, a problem, a, so a social problem can really uh, come up with a very new combination of ideas and have something interesting happen and we have seen this happen in many of our projects which uh, range from applications of mathematics to medicine to studying traffic flow uh, to studying computer security to looking at how images can be uh, processed and how they should be transmitted and so on. So anybody who is interested in looking at SNU, try keep your eyes okay. open, keep a visiting a website and see as soon as a IOIM program is announced so that you can get a taste of what is education in SNU all about.